Hi guys, it's Misty and Kim from Mimi's Wig Boutique in Dallas, Texas, and today we have a really, really exciting collection to bring you. Uh, we have the new Alexander Couture collection. Uh, it's put out by Adirans, which is the manufacturer for Noriko, Amore, and Renea Paris. So we are super excited to show it to you. I don't even, I mean, we haven't even opened the box. Mm -mm. I mean, we just took the boxes out of the box. So, I have no idea. I have a catalog, but they never look the same. So no, they don't. This is going to be a surprise to us all. Okay. Uh, first things first. Oh, I have on January by John Renault in color 10H16. Uh, it's lace front and monofilament top. So, yes. it's a beachy wave bob. And I have on the On Edge by Gabor in the Sunkissed Beige. Um, with the root, um, I think it's like GL23-101SS. It's, so it's beautiful. That color. Just a super platinum blonde. It's kind of stepping out of the norm. Well, the root's not so dark, and it's got a lot of warmth to it, and it's just, nobody else makes a color like that. Well, and this it's just so lightweight. We did a um, review of this, so if you haven't caught that, go back, and you can see what all we had to say about it. Um, okay. First things first, let's, I don't even know who this guy is, okay? So I started following him on, on Instagram and trying to find out because all of a sudden he's doing these videos with Renee Paris and all this. So um, our rep sent us some info. So while you're getting our first so quiz ready. He? Well, his name is Alexander Turnbull. Well, I guess that when they called it the Alexander Collection. Yeah, Turnbull is his last name. I don't know. Anyway. He recently won uh, the 2019 award in November for Northeastern Hairdresser of the Year. So I don't know if that's... He's got an English accent or some sort of accent. I don't know. Um, it says he's partner with Adirans Hair Goods to create 10 stunning wigs for every woman in mind. We're only showing nine of them. I think one of them either maybe they decided not to do or it's not oh. in yet. Um, it says whether your client is edgy, on the go, carefree curls, or classic simplicity, there's a style for them. Um, he's got three cap collections. I don't know what we're going to be doing in what order, so let's just talk about them up front, I guess. Um, kind of the same classic, you know, one is machine made, which is, you know, just with the elastic bands, um, elastic strap, all machine made. One is a monofilament part with a lace front, and one is a monofilament top, single layer monofilament top with lace front. So, we'll tell you as we go along. And so, it looks, they've kept the same color that, um, color palette that uh, Noriko does. Yeah, so if the color says I Smoka, then it pretty well is I Smoka. Yeah. Um, okay, so what are we starting with? Albi? We're Albi? starting with Albi. Albi is a monofilament top, full monofilament top, um, and I'm going to put on Nutmeg F. I'm putting on I Smoka R. How's the cat feel? It does not feel all that generous. You know um, what? This their tags say Renee of Paris. Huh. So it doesn't have his name in them, so I guess that's just, you know. Yeah, the cap's a little snug. Yeah. For sure. Um, a little snug. Um so let's just see what, what it says about Albie. Okay. Um, let's see. It says it's a monofilament, which it is. The fringe is three and a half, crown five point one, nape two point three six, and weight is two point one five. So even oh, though it's, it's lightweight, it's lightweight. The tightness I think makes it feel a little heavier yeah. than what it is. Well, and because it's monofilament here and it's got the short layers, it's a little bit heavy here. But I ain't gonna lie, I can see some people liking this. That like cocoa wearers, mm -hmm. people that wanted something a little shorter with a I mean, but it's still got some, it's still wispy in the back. It's got a neckline, but it's got some movement and it's all messy. Yeah. I mean, it's not something I would wear, but I can see. Oh, I can see a lot of people wanting to wear this. Let's switch. Okay. Goodness gracious. Maybe I didn't undo the straps or something. There or my head has grown. That See, one, this one feels bigger. Yeah, this one feels much tighter that than that one. That thing was tight. That felt like a petite. And the straps are out. I mean, there's yeah. no more tightening. Um, let's see. 
So this is the, again, you know, this almost looks just like a creamy toffee R. The nutmeg um, is not as well, red Even as the ice mocha looks a little bit different than the a other ice mocha. A less highlighted. Um, but then some of the darker pieces, but it's close. I mean, it's mm -hmm. close enough. Yeah. It's cute. Right. Albie. Yeah, I see this. I see we could get some good... Oh, I think a lot of, I mean, people are always wanting new short wigs. Mm -hmm. They don't make that many short wigs in the monofilament mm -mm. or the lace front, and so that's always something people are looking for. Yeah, that's cute. So far, so good. Okay. One down, eight to go. There we go. What are we doing now? Gabby. And this is Gabby, G-A-B-B-Y. Not to be confused with Gabby, John. Right. Oh, what color is this? Frosty Blonde. How about that? Okay, so this is um, machine made. They don't <laughs> make Frosty Blonde in hardly anything frosty anymore. Frosty Blonde in anything. This oh, so this is like a pixie cut. I need to get my brush. I kind of need to turn over to the page. All right, so this is Marble Brown, and this Marble Brown is a, it looks different than a lot of it. They, the Brene Paris is basically two. Two different marble browns. Sometimes they're fully blended and sometimes they're chunky. This one is fully blended. I'm a fan of the chunky. I am too. Not sure why they do that. Wow. They don't ask me. us. <laughs> but yeah. This. No. But. If you I mean, an, this is short. Look at these bangs. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I don't even think. Oh, if you put it at your hairline. Look at that. <laughs> but okay. you know, I, I hate to say it, but we have those customers that would love this. Yeah. See, some I mean, people, just putting a little bit of texture into it, if you were to get some product. How much does this wig, wig weigh? Oh, gosh. I don't it even can't know. It hardly anything. Let's find it. What is it, Gabby? This reminds me, I mean, obviously I don't look like her, but that Halle Berry. Oh, yeah. Which was really, really short. Yeah, it does look like that. Gabby. So it's just... Oh my gosh, super, super short. Yeah, I like your neckline's not even covered. Well, or tucked a little bit, but. Okay, I'm getting there. Gabby. Gabby. No, I'm not. Well, where is it? Okay. There we go. There we go. 2.04. Okay, so yeah, it doesn't have a lot of hair. I just am so, you know, this frosty blonde in this is actually pretty. It's, yeah, it's a good ash tone blonde. Mm -hmm. They they really quit kind of making oh that gosh, color in really so many different things. Yeah. Is it covering mine? Not really. I mean, you would have to have a, a pretty small head. You'd have to have a small head and just something where you did not want a whole lot of hair. And, I mean, like the way Misty has her spiked, you can spike it up. But, it, I mean, it's just short. What are the dimensions on this? Um, Let's see. Oh, it comes in gray. So that's good. It comes in a straight 60. It comes in a champagne R. Ooh. Interesting. Um, The fringe, is. it says it's 2.36. I don't believe that. <laughs> Crown 4.33, Nate 2.36, and then of course the weight 2.0. I mean, it's just, look how big my glasses look with this. <laughs> Let's switch. Oh. I gotta, I'm going to redo my blade grip. Gabby, Gabby. I probably need to redo mine too, as many wigs as I've put on and taken off. All right. This one feels bigger than that one. I think. Yeah. I got it stretched out for you, warmed up. Thank you. Super short. I'm kind of glad to see somebody doing something this short. Yeah, I mean it's it's hard to find a short wig. The you know there's another manufacturer that makes a pixie cut that really kind of dominates the market for this. So this, this is, is true, great. This is true pixie. I mean, look at this side here. These little pieces. Yeah. It's hanging really good. It's got a good fringe if I can show that. True pixie. I'm not too terribly fond of the straight across bangs, but, you know, a little product would take care of that. Well, but for, I mean, there's a lot of people this will work for. Absolutely. Yeah. 
Okay, Absolutely. Gabby, Frosty Blonde and Marble Brown. Let me do my... It's just a surprise for what's next because I have no idea. Okay, this is Sue. Sue. What's it up with my hair? <laughs> Alright. Sue. Alright, and I'm going to put on raspberry ice. This is a lace front monofilament part. What was the other was machine made? The, the other was machine made. Okay, and this is going to be Mochaccino R. You know, Elisa just did so good with a bunch of these different colors she's done for us. So far, we haven't repeated a color. Sue. Okay, so Sue looks kind of like an updated Bob. <laughs> um. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so let's see if we can get this. So it's kind of got a stack like Corey, but then it's longer here and it's got some wave to it. Yeah, and I can't tell which direction it's wanting to wave. I've seen worse. Oh, you know what? On Halloween, this could have been your flapper wig. Yeah, it would have been a great. It would, if you'd have, if only you'd have got that feather in. You know that. Don't bring up the peacock <laughs> feather. The great peacock yeah. feather incident of 2019. Amazon did not come through that. Amazon time. almost lost my thirteen dollars a month. <laughs> no, they you know that's going to shut the door. No, they didn't. Going to shut that whole new warehouse you're, down. You're addicted to <laughs> Amazon, just like me. So it's got a cute stack back here. It does. The back's cute. So, I, I mean, this is really just an updated Corey, just a little bit different version. I like the bang. Yeah, the because bang's nice. You can make it, you know, flat and well, smooth. You could even you kind could, of redirect some of this and just do a fringe. Yeah. I don't know about this, though. They're really pronounced. I feel like I have sideburns. Well, or like it tusks. <laughs> It's not for everybody. It's not for everybody. But, you know, I feel like with just a little straightening those out, this would be a cute wig. Well, but then if you straighten it out, then you go to Corey, so. True. Maybe I'll lock it in the red. Oh, I'm sorry. Sorry. See, I already like it better in the red. The red has a better curl pattern to yeah. it. You're right. That just goes, this one, yeah. I think you could put some product in and get a little actual. What do they call those back in the day? Kiss curls? Spit curls. <laughs> Spit curls. <laughs> That's what they call All right. Kiss curls does sound a little better. but Okay, let's see what it is. What is it called again? Sue. Sue. Okay. Sue. See, in the picture, it looks straight. It does. Let me show them the picture. See, that's... It doesn't look the same. That's Sue. And what is that? Um, uh, creamy toffee or long root? Uh-huh. And they're okay. making marble brown long root as well. Okay. Um, since the fringe is three and a half, crown nine, nape 1.57. So it's even shorter than wow. the pixie. And then the weight is 2.89 ounces. It does feel a little heavier. Yeah, it does. But yeah, with some redirecting at the front, a little dry shampoo... This kind of um, reminds me of a Shader Eden, which is the what the Noriko oh. just kind of put out with that stack. Yeah. I like the stack. Yeah. The stack back. This, um, this is See, great for people that say they want something a little different than what they've been wearing. They wear a classic bob. Yeah. And you know what? I'm just, I'm kind of excited that Renee of Paris and Noriko and Adderans has partnered with somebody different. Yeah. 